George Ford was bemused by a controversial refereeing decision in England's Six Nations win over Wales, England. Fly half George Ford has questioned a controversial refereeing decision during England's Guinness Six Nations victory over Wales on Saturday. He was prevented from completing a conversion of Ben Earl's 20th minute try by wing Rio Dyer. After taking a small step left as part of his pre-kick ritual, Ford looked to referee James Dolman for help, but was told that his movement meant Wales were free to charge down the kick. World Rugby later clarified that any movement enables the defending side to begin their run. Ford was puzzled by the decision, which could have been crucial in a game that England won by just two points. Doesn't make sense to me. I'm trying to use the full shot clock time as we've got men in the sin bin, said Ford, referring to Ollie Chesham and Ethan Roots who were off the field at the time. He added, you're at the back of your stance, you have your routine, and if adjusting your feet like that is initiating your run-up, then some. Of us kickers are going to have to stand like statues at the back of our run-up now. As a kicker you want to get a feel and sometimes you don't quite feel right at the back of your run-up. So you adjust it a bit and think right. I've got it now. You want your chest to be at the ball and all those things. What it means for us kickers is that we've got to be ultra diligent with our setup and process. Because if they're going to go down that route and look for stuff like that, we can't afford that.